You guys know something I forgot to mention in the previous episodes is that uh, when I was roaming around Hogwarts and uh, outside of Hogwarts, I actually ended up stumbling stumbling upon another uh, Merlin's, uh, I guess, puzzle, and I completed it. And it was uh, completely different than the uh, first one we did. So that uh, leads me to believe there's each one is going to be different in a sense. I'm honestly trying to remember if the dragon was here in the movies like if it was in this class specifically because i'm not sure if it was i think it was because wasn't it in the um order of the phoenix um one of those like pixies almost dropped it on the uh on the group when it wasn't order of the phoenix it was um it was uh chamber of secrets there we go Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Oh yeah, we're definitely practicing this. It's kind of crazy that uh, Harry Potter or Harry just basically used this spell the entire time, besides uh, P the Patrona spell. Um, I don't think I ever saw him do like another one. I think there was uh, one he actually did against Malfoy. I think it was uh, a forbidden spell that he did against Malfoy, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, yeah, for the main, uh, I guess. Time he was just using Expelliarmus, which is uh pretty interesting. Uh, so it's a damage uh spell, okay. Uh, so this should be interesting. All right, so uh we're gonna get rid of uh get rid of this one. All right, so uh yeah, let's, uh there we go. Expelliarmus, you seem to have the right to be Incendium. Oh, you know, I think the effects are going to be a bit more different, you know, against actual opponents. I don't think uh, it really does justice going up against a dummy, but uh, I think it's still pretty cool. I like it. Accio. I think I'm gonna keep these uh, spells together for the meantime. Professor, do you have a moment? I do. What is it? I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. Although, we got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigellus Black for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. Uh, I, I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. I'm not sure what that means, but it sounds horrible. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard, that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Ah! As you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. Now, 
I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Keep up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. That's actually really interesting that she and uh, Professor Black were actually, like, in a sense, together in the same, uh, well, in the same class, in a sense. And the reason why she's this old is because, uh, well, I guess, uh, I guess one of her spells, or uh, yeah, one of her spells, I guess, went wrong and uh, it got her that way. So uh, yeah, that's pretty crazy. That's still uh, horrible. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna be ending the video here. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. And uh, next episode, we're going to continue with the main story. So uh, yeah, I guess we'll see you guys next time.